Sobbing Prince Harry pours frustration on Meghan Markle as they're banned from spending Christmas with the royal family in Sandringham. A royal family Christmas drama unfolds. A Christmas ban that left the world shocked. It was a cold December evening. The winds of change were blowing through the British royal family. The news hit hard. Prince Harry and Meghan Markle, the Duke and Duchess of Sussex, were banned from Christmas at Sandringham. This ban was a shock to the family that values tradition and unity. The world gasped. Why would the royal family exclude its most famous prince and his wife during Christmas? And how did Prince Harry and Meghan react to being shut out again? But let's go back to the start. When Prince Harry's frustrations boiled over, he poured his heart out to Meghan. They were caught between the life he once knew and the life he chose. The Royal Rift. How it all came to this. Years ago, no one thought Prince Harry would be estranged from his family at Christmas. But here we are, with the crown reflecting real-life royal tensions. The cracks in Harry's relationship with the royal family started years before he married Meghan. His childhood, living in William's shadow, and the loss of his mother, Princess Diana, shaped him. These experiences made him wary of royal duties and the media. Then Meghan came along. The American actress brought a fresh spirit to the monarchy, but her modern outlook also highlighted the monarchy's deep-rooted issues. Questioning the system, did Meghan shake up more than just the monarchy's image? Was she the change Harry had been waiting for? The tension grew as Meghan faced relentless media scrutiny. The couple felt they had little support from the firm. In 2020, they shocked everyone by stepping back as senior royals. Their decisions sparked debates worldwide. But even after their departure, the drama continued. The Christmas Ban, Tradition versus Modern Family Sandringham at Christmas is a celebration of royal traditions. The Queen's holiday message, walks to church, and family lunches are all part of it. These rituals are what make the British monarchy special. For years, Harry was a part of these festivities. Even after his mother's loss, Sandringham remained a place for family gatherings. But this year, he wasn't invited. The decision to exclude Harry and Meghan was a culmination of growing tensions. The couple's interview with Oprah Winfrey and Harry's memoir, Spare, caused a rift with the royal family. But what does this mean for Harry and Meghan, who are trying to build a new life in California? A royal tradition broken. How does the exclusion of Harry and Meghan from Sandringham signal a deeper, possibly irreparable, fracture in the royal family? Harry's emotional outpouring, frustration or freedom. Harry has always felt trapped by royal rules. But this latest exclusion hit him hard. His friends say he was devastated and worried about his kids, Archie and Lilibet. Harry broke down in a shocking moment with Meghan. He was not just upset about Christmas. He felt stifled by being second and misunderstood his whole life. His tears were filled with sadness and fears for the future. Meghan reassured him they were starting anew. They could make their own traditions free from royal expectations. This was a chance to create something different. Building new traditions, how will Harry and Meghan carve out their own identity and holiday traditions, and what does this mean for their relationship with the royal family? Meghan's role, support or strain. Meghan has often been seen as the villain in the royal story, but she has been Harry's rock, helping him escape a suffocating life. She has been his support. Some wonder if Meghan's American values and outspoken nature strain Harry's family ties. Could her modern views clash with his traditional roots? Relatable challenge. How often do we find ourselves torn between old traditions and new beginnings in our own lives? Is Meghan truly the cause of the royal rift, or is she helping Harry break free from a world that never suited him? Christmas without the crown. What happens next? Harry and Meghan will spend another Christmas away from the royal family. Questions about reconciliation are on everyone's mind. Has the damage been too great? Their decision to leave the monarchy is brave but lonely. They face constant media scrutiny and public backlash. But they're willing to pay this price for their freedom. Perhaps this Christmas will start new traditions for them. A quieter holiday with their children, away from royal eyes. They might find the peace they've been searching for. A new beginning. 
Can Harry and Meghan's new life in America offer them the happiness they've been chasing, or will they always feel the tug of their royal past? A call to reflect. Where do you stand? The royal drama mirrors our own struggles. We've all felt torn between tradition and change. Prince Harry and Meghan's story is about human resilience under pressure. So what would you do in their shoes? Would you fight for reconciliation or embrace a new life? This Christmas, let's reflect on family, tradition, and the courage to follow our own path. Your turn. Share your thoughts. Do you think Harry and Meghan made the right choice by stepping back from royal duties? Should they have stayed and tried to navigate the challenges from within the royal family? Let us know your thoughts in the comments below. And don't forget to share this article with someone who might appreciate a fresh perspective on the royal drama, the media's role, fueling the fire or reporting the facts. No royal story is complete without the media's role. Harry and Meghan's story is no exception. They've faced relentless tabloid coverage, often biased and controversial. Harry has always been upset about the media, thanks to his mom's tragic death. The constant invasion of privacy and harsh press have weighed heavily on him. Meghan, as an outsider, faced intense scrutiny, making Harry even more protective. In interviews, Harry has shared how the media influenced his decision to leave royal life. The couple's interview with Oprah Winfrey showed their efforts to protect their mental health and family. They wanted to escape the toxic tabloid environment in the UK. Should public figures like Harry and Meghan face this much media attention? Or has the press gone too far? When does the public's right to no clash with a family's privacy? The ripple effect, impact on the royal family. The ban on Harry and Meghan from Christmas at Sandringham affects the royal family deeply. Queen Elizabeth II balanced tradition and progress well. But since her death, King Charles III is facing new challenges. Harry and Meghan's departure complicates his efforts to modernize the monarchy. Prince William, next in line to the throne, is caught in the middle of family tensions. His relationship with Harry has been strained for years. The latest developments have made things worse, with the brothers spending Christmas apart. What does this mean for the monarchy's future? Will Prince George, Princess Charlotte, and Prince Louis inherit a fractured family? Or can the bonds be mended for a united future? Sibling rivalry or something deeper? Is the rift between Harry and William just a phase? Or is it deeper? Could the Christmas ban be the final straw? Or is reconciliation still possible? The public's view. Divided loyalties. Opinions on Harry and Meghan are split. Some see them as victims of an outdated institution. Others believe they've abandoned their royal duties, leaving the monarchy vulnerable. But their decision to step down and move to the U.S. has also resonated with many. Meghan's experiences with racism and the couple's desire to protect their children have sparked global conversations. Their story is relatable, dealing with family tensions, personal well-being, and finding a balance between tradition and modernity. The couple's philanthropy, including the Archule Foundation, has shaped their post-royal identity. Yet, their estrangement from the royal family is a source of sadness for those who celebrated their wedding as a sign of progress. A story that mirrors our own. Can you relate to Harry and Meghan's struggle to find their place? How have their challenges resonated with your own experiences of family conflict or societal expectations? Lessons we can learn from this royal drama. Harry and Meghan's situation offers real lessons. It's about family dynamics, making difficult decisions, and facing the consequences of stepping away from expectations. Boundaries are important. Harry and Meghan's journey highlights the need for setting boundaries, even with family. Sometimes, we must step back from toxic situations or people for our mental and emotional health, no matter how hard it is. You can't please everyone. The couple's decision to step down as senior royals was met with both praise and criticism. It's clear they could never please everyone. This teaches us to focus on our own values and happiness, not others' approval. The power of communication. Misunderstandings and miscommunications have fueled tension between Harry, Meghan, and the royal family. This shows how crucial open, honest dialogue is for resolving conflicts and keeping relationships healthy. Mental health matters. Harry and Meghan have talked about how royal duties and media scrutiny affected their mental health. 
Their choice to prioritize their well-being over tradition shows mental health is as important as physical health. The future for Harry, Meghan, and the royal family. As another royal controversy fades, the question remains, what's next for Harry and Meghan? Will they keep their distance from the royal family, or is reconciliation possible? It's hard to guess their future with the monarchy. But one thing is sure, Harry and Meghan aim to create their own legacy. They want to focus on philanthropy, mental health advocacy, and independence. For the royal family, the challenge is huge. King Charles and Prince William must regain public trust and keep the monarchy relevant. Can they do this while fixing the internal issues exposed by Harry and Meghan's departure? What will 2024 bring? Could the next year be a turning point for the Sussexes and the royal family? Will time heal old wounds, or is a permanent divide starting? Final thoughts. What does this mean for us? The story of Harry and Meghan reflects our own lives. It's about the struggle between tradition and progress, family expectations, and personal happiness. It's about finding a balance between being true to ourselves and honoring our roles.